24. Day 124. It is day 124. Day 124. Hey there, Kinder Ruggets. It's me, Mr. Bot, Mr. Robot, and I'm excited to be with you today. Look, today. Today is March 15th, 2020, and it's actually Monday, March 15th, 2020. And tomorrow's the 16th, and 17th is St. Patrick's Day. Yeah, we got this clover here, and maybe you heard of a leprechaun. Maybe you want to build a leprechaun trap. Maybe we'll talk about that. Build a leprechaun trap. That's pretty awesome. Anyways, I hope you're doing well. I hope you had a good weekend. I am ready to rock for that guy, Mr. C. You ready, camera person? She looks like she's ready. All right, Mr. C, let's do this. All right, Mr. Bot. All right, so today, of course, we have our... Oh, I even got my kazoo open, but apparently I didn't get it out. It's here we go. <laughs> So, with our question, question of the day, right, a question is a type of sentence, by the way. I'm going to ask you about what you like. This week, we talked about food a little last week, I think, but this week's all about food. I like food, and there's different types of food. For example, if you look at the bottom, hmm, what food do you see? What do you think these things look like? Oh, you're right. That is a strawberry. And you're also right. That's a watermelon. Oh, you got it. Grapes. Blueberries. An apple. An orange. We got an orange, right? All of these are types of what? These are all types of fruit. Fruit. Fruit is a little bit of a tricky word because the vowel's in the middle. But... Here's what this says. What, this is a sight word, what? Fruit, ooh, and make this look a little more like an I with my dot. What fruit do you like to eat? Most of these are sight words. What's a sight word? Do's a sight word, use a sight word, likes a sight word, to's a sight word. So only fruit and eat should be a little challenging. So you're gonna tell me what fruit do you like to eat? And you're going to say, I like to eat. Then you're going to do your best to sound out your fruit. Like if you want orange or strawberry. Stretch it out, right? Apple. Watermelon. Grapes. Blueberries. And there's lots of things that aren't on this list, right? But what fruit do you like to eat? You know, so I'm going to write a complete sentence on my whiteboard here. Let me do it. So I'm going to write I, finger space, like. I can look over here. I can pause if I need to. To eat. To eat. Let's see. I'm going to say this word. Banana. Banana. Period. I like to eat banana. Oh, that doesn't sound right. I think it's I like to eat bananas. With same snake at the end. I like to eat bananas. And so, of course, I'm going to open up my seesaw activity. And if I want to even bonus points, if you want to draw a little like your little fruit that you like, like I like bananas. If you just want to draw it, if you're on paper, you could even color it in. Okay, let's draw one more banana because usually bananas, right, they come in bunches, a bunch of banana. So here's it is, I like to eat bananas. It's good, use your sounds, try to write by yourself. Okay, and I'm gonna go to add response here. And I'm going to, of course, watch the whole morning message. But I'm going to go to my page right here, right? I'm going to take a picture. And remember, you want to get a good picture of the whole thing. So I'm going to give this to camera person. Hopefully, camera person is which way? Is it facing the right way? No. No? Okay. You're going to flip it around for me? Thanks, camera person. All right. So 
Here we go. She's going to take a picture. Make sure you get the text, right? That's the most important part. All right, camera person. Did you get that for me? All right. Thank you. I like to eat bananas. I'm going to stretch that out. Hit the record button. Record. I like to eat bananas. All right? See how it turns out. Record. I like to eat bananas. Mmm. Yum, yum, yum. All right. Good job on that. So, moving on. By the way, you are going to do some jump roping today because exercise is so important, right? So, here we go. Today, I'm going to try to trick you a little bit. I'm seeing what you know. I have given you, check this out. I've given you a part. I've given you one part. What is your other part going to be? So here's one, right? Two. Is it going to match that? I hope so. Otherwise, I may be missing a magnet. Yep. Three. Okay. I've given you three. And look, you have something plus three equals something. So three with something else is going to give me something here. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go to my morning message, right? And I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to get my uh, dots here. And we could even do blue. And we're going to do a one, two, three. Grab my hand. I'm going to put a three here and a three here. Now, I'm going to combine a number with three. You know what number I'm going to combine with three? I really like the number six. So I'm going to go six and six. So let me see. And then I need six dots here. You can do whatever number you want. You could do six. You can do something else. You get to choose. Let me see. What color for dots? So uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. So I just added six more dots. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Look, I can put the number nine here. Oops, just hit undo. Right, grab my hand and the number nine and the number nine. All right, so then we can go like this, right? Hit the record button. Um, the number of the day is three. I chose to add six with three, and that gave me the whole of nine. These are the parts. This is the whole. Six plus three is equal to nine. I have one, two, three blue ones, and one, two, three, four, five, six black ones, and that gives me one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Done. Right? But, of course, yours, friend, is going to... Let's see... What you're going to do is you're you're going to just choose whatever you want. So do you have to choose six? No, nope, you don't have to choose six. You can choose any number you want, any number you want, okay? As long as you are adding to the number three. So I chose this one, all right? So remember, you got to do your best. Can't wait to see you read these. I will say some of these are tricky. I did put some CVC words in here. And, of course, you got your jump rope that I get to see you do. And with that, Kinder Rockets, go ahead. I'm going to hit the draft. Happy day 124. Always remember, I'm a Kinder Rocket. I'm kind. I'm safe. I do my best. I'm a kind rocket. See you in class. Bye-bye.